Hello and good evening. I'm Ethan Burks with your top stories. Indiana Governor Eric Holcomb is giving his support to schools who are implementing their own mask mandates. Holcomb's stance differs from Republican governors who have some have issued statewide orders banning mask wearing in schools. Several Indiana school districts have been forced back into online learning due to outbreaks of the virus. The governor maintains each local community should decide for themselves on the best safety measures. Congresswoman Victoria Sparks has yet to indicate whether she will support President Joe Biden's nearly trillion dollar infrastructure bill, but she says no matter how she votes, she supports broadband expansion. Everything that we're able to invest and pay for, you know, we should be able to invest. But things that we cannot have pay for, the things that don't bring long-term value, we might have to put, deliberate some other time. A roundtable was hosted by Lieutenant Governor Suzanne Crouch and other state leaders to discuss best practices and challenges with broadband. Potentially $65 million could be put toward broadband in the bill. The Wheeler Mission Shelter off 3rd Street in Bloomington looks to expand its services by constructing a new building next to the existing one. This project has some local businesses concerned, however, that it will create more vandalism and property damage, which they say keeps getting worse in the area. The proposal will be ready for review by City Council sometime in the next few months. And a quick checkup on tonight's weather forecast. It's a low of 68 degrees with a 30% chance of thunderstorms. And then there's more rain in the forecast the rest of the week. 30% tomorrow, 50% on Thursday, and then hovering around 40 to 50% on Saturday and Friday. And then more storms to end the weekend on Sunday. For more news, be sure to check out our content online at WTIUnews.org. Good night.